Hello everyone. Welcome to CSR's UPC online classes. So this uh, video will be on a particular topic from environment. Uh, it will be a particular convention which we'll be discussing. So the convention name is Barcelona Convention and its protocols. Uh, we all know about there are a lot of conventions in environment related to climate change, bio biological diversity, like even if triple C is related to climate change, CBD is related to biological diversity. Then we have <clears throat> desertification, CCD. Then we have Vienna Convention, that is ozone, that is the Montreal Protocol. Then we have a lot of conventions, okay based on different categories or different uh, topics. So this particular convention is related to uh, environment, but what exactly this Barcelona convention and what are the protocols? So we'll be uh, basically going through this particular topic, fine. So Barcelona convention, it is a convention for the protection of Mediterranean Sea against pollution. So this convention is subject to a particular region, that region is Mediterranean Sea. So it was adopted in 1976, entered into force in 1978. You have to also remember the year because question can come in match the following, they can come. Like this year also, last year the question came, like three to four conventions were there and they were related to which of the following. For example, that Almata declaration had come. It was related to health. Okay. So this Barcelona convention was amended in 1995. Okay. And was renamed as the convention for the protection of the marine environment and coastal region of the Mediterranean. So the name was changed and this name came into force in 2004. Now it is developed under UNEP. There is a there is a program of UNEP which is a very common famous program that is a regional seas program. Okay. It is a regional convention because it is related to a particular region that is the Mediterranean Sea. So obviously it will be a regional convention and obviously, India will not be a part of this convention because India does not lie in the Mediterranean Sea. So it's a regional convention to prevent and abate pollution from ships, aircraft, and land-based sources in the Mediterranean Sea. It includes and not limited to dumping, runoff, and discharges. It means like any kind of pollution in uh, particular to that particular region that is the Mediterranean Sea, this convention deals with any kind of pollution. It is not only limited to kind of a dumping runoff or a discharge, mostly all kinds of pollution which happens in the Mediterranean Sea, this convention will deal with all those things. Now the member countries, there are 22 countries. These are the countries, no need to uh, remember the names, only you need to know India is not a part. So obviously the, the border countries of Mediterranean, now this is the Mediterranean Sea, the border countries of Mediterranean Sea will be a part of this convention. It is very evident. All countries with the Mediterranean shoreline as well as the European Union, even European Union, these are the countries of European Union. Okay, Not all European Union countries, remember, or all Union, European Union countries are not member. Those European countries which are bordering this particular uh, sea, Mediterranean Sea. NGOs with a stated interest and third party governments are allowed as observer status. NGOs can also come like they're not members, but they'll be participating in this convention as an observer status. Parties are allowed to extend the application of the convention to the coastal areas within their own territory. Okay. Now this Barcelona convention has seven protocols. For example, there's a convention even if triple C. It also has a pro protocol called Kyoto. Kyoto Protocol. It also has Paris Agreement under UNFCCC. So similarly, Barcelona Convention also has seven protocols. Just you need to know the names. That will be enough. Barcelona Convention and the seven protocols adopted in the framework for this Mediterranean Action Plan constitute the principal regionally legally binding multilateral environment agreement in the Mediterranean. These are all agreements or protocol. For example, Vienna uh, Convention on Ozone Layer. So the agreement of the protocol is the uh, Montreal Protocol. Similarly, <clears throat> similarly in Barcelona Convention, there is a protocol called Dumping Protocol. So it deals with any kind of dumping activities in the Mediterranean region. So its objective is for the contracting parties. Contracting parties mean those are those have accepted the convention, those have signed the convention to take all appropriate measures to prevent, abate, and eliminate 
to the fullest extent possible pollution of the mediterranean sea by dumping of waste or other matter so it relates to dumping of waste so that that's why the name is dumping protocol so dumping protocol comes under the barcelona convention it prohibits all dumping activities with the exception of waste or other matters listed in the protocol right it prohibits mostly all kind of dumping activities but any dumping activities which is like uh, exempted so it's mentioned in the protocol which are like exception kind of dumping activities are allowed for example uh, uh, dredged material fish waste vessels platforms and inert or uncontaminated geological material so it, it is mentioned okay these are the waste uh, like these waste are uh, exceptions uh, in this protocol so dumping protocol is one of this uh, the protocol of this convention the next protocol is prevention and emergency protocol prevention and emergency protocol this con it's concerning cooperation in combating pollution of mediterranean sea by oil it deals with oil and other harmful substances in case of emergency so it deals with any kind of emergency may or any oils uh, oil spill hota ya fir any kind of harmful substances it comes so it will prevent that particular uh, stuff so this protocol deals with that third land based sources protocol the objective of this lbs or the land based sources protocol is to take all appropriate measures to prevent abate and eliminate to the fullest extent possible uh, fullest extent possible possible pollution of the mediterranean sea by from land based resources and activities by the reduction and phasing out of substances that are toxic persistent and liable to bioaccumulate listed in the protocol so these particular protocol deals with any kind of land based resources and activities which are toxic which are like which bioaccumulates so it will try to reduce this protocol will try to eliminate those particular stuff these address persistent organic pollutants pops we know what is pops reduction of biological oxygen demand biological oxygen demand also is a static topic of environment the reduction of inputs of mercury the management of marine litter sustainable consumption and production in the mediterranean next another one protocol name is specially protected areas and biological diversity protocol so biological diversity protocol it deals with some special protected areas in that region protected areas in that mediterranean region and also to serve the or also to protect the biological diversity in the mediterranean under the protocol the parties are called to protect areas of particular natural or cultural value through the establishment of particular areas that are the spas specially protected areas or specially protected areas of mediterranean importance spa so this term can come related to which convention it is barcelona convention in particular this protocol to protect the threatened or endangered species of flora and fauna listed in the protocol annexes any kind of species which is mentioned in annex so they have to protect it another protocol is there that is the offshore protocol offshore protocol deals with any kind of offshore oil and gas activities in the mediterranean and includes measures to reduce pollution from all phases of offshore activities to respond to offshore pollution incidents and concerning liability and compensation any kind of offshore uh, pollution incidents happens so like who is liable how much to compensate all those stuffs are mentioned in this particular protocol the name is offshore protocol just you need to know the names of the protocol names because the name itself says everything like what it does okay and you have to know under which Uh, convention it comes that is the barcelona convention two more protocols that is one is the hazardous waste protocol so this hazardous waste protocol deals with the prevention of pollution of mediterranean sea by transboundary movements of hazardous waste and their disposal now already we know now this is in particular related to mediterranean sea that is the transboundary movements of hazardous Based on the disposal, there is a very famous convention mentioned in the comment. What is the convention name? Okay, which deals with overall transboundary movements of hazardous waste. Now, this one is in particular to Mediterranean Sea. Overall, the world there is a particular very famous. Everyone also knows it. You can mention in the comments. So, the objectives of hazardous waste protocol is to protect human health and marine environment against adverse effects of hazardous waste. So basically, it deals with any kind of transboundary movements of hazardous waste in this particular area, that is the Mediterranean Sea, 
another uh, protocol is also there that is the integrated coastal zone management protocol so it deals with coastal zone so we also have ic zm we also have in our india also there is an integrated coastal zone management so there also there is an integrated coastal zone management protocol so it deals with uh, like here the parties are uh, called to take necessary measures to strengthen regional cooperation in order to meet the objectives of the integrated coastal zone management so in order to have a very nice coastal zone how to manage the coastal zone such measures include like those aimed at protecting the characteristics of certain specific coastal ecosystem jaise ki wetlands ho gaya wetland estuaries marine habitats coastal forest wood dunes all these things are part of coastal ecosystem so how to protect it those aimed at ensuring the sustainable use of the coastal zone and ensuring that the coastal marine economy is adapted to the fragile nature of coastal zones so these are the seven protocol names we have to remember and the name the parent convention is the barcelona convention the year name what when it came and it is related to the mediterranean sea so these are the countries here you can check and this area is very important from mapping three to four mapping questions will come so you can have a look like the border countries in is uh, border countries border seas all those things you have to uh, have a very strong knowledge because two to three or four questions may come from uh, mapping now nowadays geography physical geography is not coming they are putting questions from mapping so this is the trend so the countries which are bordering the this is the mediterranean sea so these are the countries which are the members okay you can see this color this is the color barcelona convention that that will that much is enough okay so this is the color okay so from a european union okay no need to even no need to remember because they will not ask which are the countries because india is not a member so basically you need to know okay 22 countries bordering the mediterranean sea now this is the mediterranean sea so all those countries which are bordering the mediterranean sea you have to remember okay all are you have to remember because it, it will help you in map work so uh, this was uh, this one uh, is one of the topic i thought of covering because it's not covered uh, in most of the current affair magazine and questions are coming like lot of convention questions are coming nowadays so i thought of covering okay so one question uh, on this uh, consider the following statements about the barcelona convention this regional convention was adopted in 1976 to protect marine environment and the coastal region of the mediterranean sea against pollution yes it is correct this convention is limited to dumping runoff and discharges no it is not limited dumping is there runoff is there discharges there any kind of oil spill is there oil related hazardous thing all those things are covered it is not only limited to this so the answer is only one okay so these are the convention names four convention and the rest three convention i have mentioned so there are six convention there's two convention i have mentioned in the previous uh, slides so there are all total six protocols under this convention okay so uh, this this uh, that is it you can just go through again and uh, you can check my uh, different uh, lectures on mcqs modern history mcqs ancient history i have started recently there is one set modern history there are uh, there are around 90 questions there are around 10 9 uh, sets till now 8 and 9 sets you can check from the playlist there are other uh, environment mcqs also uh, you can just go through and it will help you in exam in value addition and in elimination okay okay thank you